Hi everyone, and welcome to Learn and Explore Facts. Today, we're going to be talking about the economic crisis of Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka is a beautiful island nation located in the Indian Ocean. It's known for its beaches, its tea plantations, and its rich history. But in recent years, Sri Lanka has been facing an unprecedented economic crisis. In this video, we'll explore the causes of the crisis, the impact it's had on the people of Sri Lanka, the government's response, and what the future holds for the country. Causes of the crisis There are many factors that have contributed to the economic crisis in Sri Lanka. These include A large foreign debt, Sri Lanka's foreign debt is estimated to be around $51 billion. This is a significant amount of debt for a country with a small economy. A decline in tourism. Tourism is a major source of income for Sri Lanka. In 2020, tourism revenue fell by 70% due to the COVID-19 pandemic. A drop in remittances. Remittances are money sent home by Sri Lankans working abroad. In 2020, remittances fell by 20%. A fall in agricultural production. Sri Lanka is a major agricultural exporter. But in recent years, the country has experienced droughts and other weather events that have hurt agricultural production. Government mismanagement. Some experts say that government mismanagement has also contributed to the crisis. For example, the government has been accused of borrowing too much money and not investing it wisely. Impact of the crisis. The economic crisis has had a devastating impact on the people of Sri Lanka. Inflation has soared. Inflation in Sri Lanka reached 49.7% in February 2023. This means that the prices of goods and services have risen by 49.7% in the past year. There are shortages of food, fuel, and medicine. There are long queues for food, fuel, and medicine. In some cases, people have resorted to violence to get these essential goods. Power outages are common. Power outages are common in Sri Lanka, lasting up to 10 hours per day. The currency has lost value. The Sri Lanka rupee has lost more than half of its value against the US dollar in the past year. This makes it more expensive for Sri Lankans to import goods and services. Unemployment has risen. Unemployment in Sri Lanka has risen to 6.7% in February 2023. This means that more than 600,000 people are out of work. Government's response. The government of Sri Lanka has taken some steps to address the crisis, including seeking a bailout from the International Monetary Fund, IMF. The IMF has agreed to provide Sri Lanka with a $3 billion bailout package, but the terms of the bailout have not yet been finalized. Imposing import restrictions. The government has imposed import restrictions on non-essential goods in an effort to conserve foreign currency. Raising taxes. The government has raised taxes on a variety of goods and services, including fuel, alcohol, and cigarettes. Appointing a new prime minister. The president of Sri Lanka has appointed a new prime minister, Ranil Vikramasinghe, in an effort to stabilize the country. Future of Sri Lanka. It is unclear how long it will take for Sri Lanka to recover from the economic crisis. The country will need to implement reforms to its economy and rebuild its reputation with lenders. It will also need to find ways to address the underlying causes of the crisis, such as corruption and mismanagement. The economic crisis in Sri Lanka is a reminder of the fragility of the global economy. It is also a reminder of the importance of good governance and sound economic policies. Thank you for watching.